I hear a Rocky. I hauled a couple loads of this rip raft, not here, but over on my job into the pond. That's what it is, rip raft. It's just big rocks to like help it drain and help catch like some of the bigger material. That's all I really did at work today. But I wanted to talk about how today's Friday. Happy about that. No work tomorrow because of rain. But also, I'm just tired of the four seasons. Like, I know you can say that about any state. You know, for instance, Florida. You can say the same thing about Florida. People are so tired of dealing with just pretty much one, um, how can I put it, one summer. That's it. That's all it really is, is summer. And I'm just tired of just straight up only a couple months. It's really nice out. And then for the other half of the year, it's really cold. I mean, where I'm at, we don't get a lot of snow. I mean, last year we got like six inches and I was out of work for like three days. Didn't hurt me that much because... It didn't really matter because I, I believe at that time I had money saved up. But the thing is that I don't like snow. As a kid, I loved snow because of the fact that I got a day off of school. And plus, I played in. I played football with friends, whatever other sports we played outside, snowball fights, all that. But as I've gotten older, I just came to to that point where I've just despised snow. <laughs> Especially working where I work, doing heavy equipment. We don't work. I mean, yeah, you can do snow removal if your company does it and offers it. But other than that, the only reason why my company offers it is because of the airport. Other than that, they wouldn't offer it. And <clears throat> I've never actually had to do snow removal because of the fact that um, I've just never had. Even though we've had some bad snowstorms throughout the year. But last year wasn't that bad. It's just six inches. Year before that, nothing. Just cold. Year before that, um, we got a good foot. <laughs> And then, I believe the year before that, we got some too. But I've never seen in my life more than a foot or two. And I know people in the northern states probably laugh at that and look at it like, ha, we get multiple feet a year. But like I said, I despise the snow. Despise the, I don't really care about the four seasons. Bird. He's uh, looking up at He's trying to get it. <laughs> he just scared the bird off. Even though he can't get it. Crazy dog. <clears throat> but I'm just not a fan of the four seasons. It's just real boring. Really the only things to do here during the winter is just stay the hell inside. <clears throat> I got fucking pollen on my throat. Damn it. But, I mean, unless you're an outdoorsy type person that likes to hunt and whatnot, I don't really hunt necessarily. I hunt here and there. But I really just like fishing. And that's one thing about Florida I would like is to see how the fishing is down there. Not even really just saltwater fish. I mean, I'm more talking about the lakes and the rivers and all that plus, I mean, I've always wanted to go to the Everglades and see all that. I understand that it's hot and humid and bugs, but that's what I like. But my fiance, she hates it. Like yesterday, we walked Rocky down there to the power plant and 
back. I don't know. It's about a 40 minute walk altogether. And we got, she got scared because of a turkey, I guess, flew out the tree or whatever. She, she was hearing noises. <coughs> but that's not the point. Um, she was really hot, even though it was nighttime. It was like 70 degrees, 70, 80 degrees. I think it was like right around almost 80. I was in a hoodie, even though it was a bit warm. I could take it off, but I wasn't like dying, if that makes sense. <clears throat> like right now, I wouldn't be dying. But also, I'm not the type of person to sweat. But her... She sweats. She has a like really bad sweating problem. So, even though she lived in Florida for over ten years, after moving from where we are now, um, well, not in the same county now, but an hour down south. But that's not the point. Um, she moved back up here, but I mean, like with her, it's not like. She don't like the cold. She don't like the heat. But she likes more of the spring and fall weather. But as you already know, where I'm at currently, we don't get spring and fall weather, but only a couple months, like a little bit of time. And then the rest of the time, it's either blazing hot Florida, as you already know, it's super hot year-round. So the only place that I can think of that she'd be more comfortable in would be more like uh, California. But <clears throat> that's too expensive. That's way out of my pay grade. And plus, I don't even like California. I couldn't do deal with the politics. I couldn't, do, even though I'm not a political person, I just couldn't deal with all that. And I can't deal with the laws. I just couldn't deal with it if I don't live there. My older brother lives there. My mom's over there with him right now. Because uh, he's taking her. He's not my full brother. He's my half brother. My mom's uh, son. Not my dad's son. Um, she got with my dad about 10 years after he was born. So he's about 10 years older than me. But she's he's taking her over to Hawaii. So <clears throat> a couple years ago, he took her, I think it was about five, six years ago, he took her to Ireland and Scotland and all that. And all that crap. So, yeah. But, I don't know. Four Seasons is whack. It's overrated. I don't care for it. I know people probably, if they even see this, they'll say, Florida weather is overrated too and it's too hot. But that's just me. I like it. So, let me know in the comments below what you guys think.